I'm sorry, Rook. You are not really my type anymore. I've another man that's stronger and more useful than you. I love him. So please leave me alone. Forget about me. But, but, I love you. Why can't you accept my disability? You said you love me a few weeks ago but now you are in love with another person. The man I am in love with right now is better than you because he is more gentleman and really care about me. More than you do. You are really bad at love and you try so hard to impress me. Goodbye, Rook. No please, Pon don't leave. Wait, what just happened? Where am I? Rook, the timeline has broken. Your death in the past has lead to us stuck in this void forever. You've caused a time paradox and now both of us doesn't exist. Sir, I'm sorry. I was just trying to save my friend but I forgot my objective. Now it seems like both of us will die here. Don't worry, Rook. You are actually did change the past and you did save a tons of life. What? But how? What have I changed? Do you remember the secret code I gave you? Wait a minute. Sir, never gonna give you up. Never gonna let you down. Never gonna run around at you. Yes, I do remember that code. I told that code to you and then I die because they kill me. Just by that simple line, I know you are from the future, and as soon as they killed you, I actually surrender, and our kingdom live in freedom and happy ever after. Just like what my wives wanted. So, how do we get out from this timeless void? It's simple, both of us now have a time travel ability, and we can choose a perfect timeline for us to live in. Any timeline? Is this mean that I can be with my girlfriend again? Yes. I've another man that's stronger and more useful than you. I love him. But sir, how about you? Oh well, I'm just going to stay here forever. Do not worry about me, I already did my job and when you travel to your timeline, I'm still alive there and still have memories about all of this. Goodbye, Rook. Alright. Goodbye sir. <laughs> Ah, you again. What else do you want from me? Please just leave me alone. I just want to say sorry about last night. I know I am not good enough for you and I really should be more matured about this. It's okay, Rook. We all made mistake. I also want to say sorry about being too harsh for you. I just doesn't love you anymore. I can't do anything about it. It's okay. I will respect your choice. Please take care of yourself. I will now go away from your life and we will never meet again from now. Goodbye. Oh hi, what are you doing here, huh? Rook, are you okay? Did something happen to you? Knight. You're still alive. Of course, I'm still alive, what are you talking about? Oh, never mind. I just having a bad day today. My girlfriend broke up with me because she found another man that better than me. 
I wonder who is that man she was talking about. Wait a minute, your girlfriend is a white pawn, right? Didn't you know that she will be marrying the king? She will marry the king? Yes, the king already made the announcement last night, and they will be married tomorrow. In my point of view, I think the king has stolen your girlfriend to make her his queen. Ad time. Hey, are you lonely as fuck? Well don't you worry anymore. If you click the Discord server link in the description below you will meet a lot of friend that want to play chess with you. Lonely at school because all your friend is a normie? Don't you worry, just join Mr. Mask Discord server today, and you will finally have someone to talk to. We are now almost reached 200 server members, and when time has come, we will do a chess tournament that you guys can join and have fun with. Come, join now before I kidnap all of you and sell all of your organ at the black market in Malaysia. Rook, what are you doing in my bathroom, and why do you have a gun in your hand? Sir, why did you betray me? I thought I could trust you but, you stole my girlfriend. I thought by going back to this original timeline I can live like a normal person again, and ready to move on, but you lied to me. You said I can be with my girlfriend but you lied to me. I did not know she was your girlfriend. She just come to me and asked me to marry her, so I accepted it. Now get out from my house.